what's going on. Okay, well, hey, we everybody. Go. Are we live? Are we We're live, yeah. Are we turning it off? Well, I'm just catching up to find out that Christina didn't even watch us on Saturday. So, like, really? She goes, what's the deal with this table over here? I'm like, But it was there Friday, and I was, watched Friday. And you didn't comment on how much you liked the table. I did like it. I'm just confused. It, like, everything's a little different. Well, it ain't that different. I leave for 48 hours, and, and I come sh- back. And look. I tell you, anyway, so how is everybody in Happy Land today? Happy family. I hope we're all good. Man, in California, whew, I feel sorry. And Colorado, too. I had some people comment saying, hey, we got a business bad in Colorado. So as you saw on the map, we're all the smokes going toward Colorado. So it makes it worse. And I have a cousin that lives there, and she was telling us that, ugh, not good. So today we're going to work with chocolate browns, pinks, and a little bit of mauve. But stargazers are the main thing. Some people always ask about stargazers. So I thought, oh, we can play with that today. And we're going to do three containers. We're going to do a set. There's a large, a medium, and a small. Hopefully we'll do the three containers. So the first one, I'm just going to make a traditional oval shape, the one that y'all seem to like the best. And we're going to start out with some white sumac. It's really not sumac. Don't get freaked out. If it it is, it's not the poisonous kind. This is called snow on the mountain. It's a form of euphorbia, which euphorbia is actually a form of a poinsettia. So... We have some lily grass, no, zebra grass. This stuff is brutal. You don't ever want to go back. Like when you put the insertion in, you want to pull your hand back because it will cut you like nobody's business. Some nine bark. We've got some coxcomb. We have some more Queen Anne's lace in that burgundy color. We have some hanging amaranthus, which Everyone always goes, it's dead. It's not dead. It's just the way it's supposed to be. As Freya Rice says, it's the nature of it. But it's in the same family as this coxcomb. I mean, that same variety. Then we're going to do a little bit of this darker maroon color, St. John's Award or Hibercum or Coffee Berry. We brought back a few of the country blue roses. Which we had a customer, someone ask where those came from, what vendor. Mm-hmm. It's Trilogy, I believe. Okay. So, trilogy, trilogy. And then we have some Lusianthus, which is kind of pretty, kind of kind of different. Not really pink, not really white, not really yellow. It's kind of a little combo. These beautiful Stunning. hydrangea. Looks like big old things of cotton candy to me. And then we have our stargazer or rubrum, pink rubrum lilies. So, let's get started. So everyone um, is doing well in the Happy Family today. We have a few fr- a few family members that said they're getting ready for the hurricane. Ugh. We have friends from South Carolina, Delaware, Texas, Connecticut, Fayetteville, Scotland. A lot of people said they're glad that I'm back and asked if I had a good trip. I did. I just went to Branson. One of my dearest friends from high school got married, and we even had time to talk. I was there. We really haven't. We haven't talked. He knows nothing day. about it. <laughs> I took pictures of the flowers for him to see. He hasn't even he just seen don't them. Know, I haven't even looked because we came in this morning. Actually, we came in last night. I mean, yesterday, and haven't stopped running all day long. Exactly. So, so but we, I'm back. I'm happy to be back with y'all. And well, we're glad you're back. Here I am. I'll be here. We're glad. Um, we have friends from Louisiana, Florida, awesome. Pennsylvania, Texas. So I had someone comment the other day too that I need to talk more and explain what I'm doing more. She can't understand what I'm doing. So let me do that real quick. So talk. Let's hear it. <laughs> we you don't you like so that. We missed you so much, Christina. Mm-hmm. I know. Anyway, you. so we did four pieces of white sumac, north, south, east, west. The great thing about this, it's kind of vani, so you really can't tell that it's strategically put in four corners. Then we went back and added two pieces of this white euphorbia, or snow on the mountain, which is kind of euphorbia. So, now let's go back and add just a couple blooms of the hydrangea. Man, these leaves are gorgeous. I hate pulling those off, but my oh my, you got to, you know what you got to do. We're going to just add just maybe two of those, right? We have friends from Denmark, from Prince Edward's Island. Oh, cool. Maryland, Whitehall. Perfect. These containers are so pretty. Like, yeah, 
They look Could like, you put like an orchid in one of those smaller ones? Yeah, actually, it would be cool to put an orchid in this one because the height would make yeah. it look really dramatic. Or that's what these were actually going to be used for, probably, long in the short. Well, I keep seeing them in the back, and yeah, I really do exactly. like them. And then also, they um, some people we were talking about it looking like a swirly chocolate um, and vanilla swirl, but everyone else said it looked like marble to them, which I, I think it looks like marble, it like, like chocolate marble. marble. Yeah. So now we're going to go ahead and Peel those guard petals off. Really can't tell. We forgot to show the rose arrangement. Okay, and I've been looking at it. I observed it today with my long to-do list at my desk. And <laughs> they really don't look any different. There's only one that looks like it's kind of... It's kind of turned wacky colors doodle. almost. Yeah. yeah, wacky doodle, but... But nothing else. But nothing really major at all. So mm. you may not be happy I'm back, but a lot of our happy family is Oh, happy come on back. now. Quit fishing for compliments uh -huh. there. Uh -huh. We have, um, oh my goodness, we have someone from India today, Oklahoma. Oh, cool. Okay, so how do you stop this from getting top heavy and tipping over? Mm, it's really not a problem because this container is so heavy and I'm really actually taking the, the volume out this way and not so much up. So it's really not that big of an issue, I don't think, not yet. Could happen, but we'll see what we'll see if it does happen. Miss Carolyn said, "Chris, you are the flower whisperer." Uh, I don't know about all that. But that's very kind. So tell us about your trip. They all want to know. Okay, so I got there <laughs> Thursday night. My friend, we were actually Girl State roommates. She got oh, married. Oh, that this one? Weekend. Yeah, Jessica, who's oh, registered really? with us. Yeah. Okay. So she got married in Branson at Big Cedar. So like the rehearsal dinner was at Big Cedar, and then. Um, everyone, they rented out the bowling alley and we all went bowling. Oh, fun. And then... How'd you do? Okay, I lost both rounds to the same person, one by one, one by four. So that's a touchy subject. Don't get me on that. I tried really I noticed hard. you didn't tell me what you actually bowled, though. Oh, it was 112. Oh, uh, okay. And somebody else had 113. Okay. So, hmm. Hmm. Um, and then she got married in like the prettiest little chapel at Big Cedar. It was just beautiful. She actually gets her sneak peek pictures today, so I'm so oh, excited. Cool. And you know what? Their flo her floor said she'll get all of her pictures in ten days. Her you know, usually or it's a photographer. Like, a photographer. You know, usually it takes like you know eight to ten weeks. Ten days. Hmm. Well, there you go. So it was a great trip, and my dad went, and so it was. You know, it I think a lot good. of that has to do with now everything's so digital. That it, it it gets processed. I mean, it gets cleaned. Well, they right. are able to edit photo, photos a lot faster now than they used to. So I think that may be part of the, you know, not a problem, but why it's changed so much. So it was a great trip, but I'm happy to be back. So Miss Yolanda uh, said, Chris, you're really that good. Accept it, buddy. <laughs> well, um, Miss Martha kind. said she's getting ready for the hurricane. Oh, I feel so bad for everybody. I Ugh. know. But it looked like that Marco kind of has fizzled out a little bit more than they thought he was, which is good. But Laura, mm, she looks like she might get mean here at the end. I sure hope Ms. not. Miss Linda said that that was a very nice write-up about you this weekend. Oh, thanks. It really was. If well, y'all did not read that of Mr. Chris, it's on our Facebook page. I think you shared, we shared it yesterday. There's something with it? What? There's something with that? What do you mean with that? I thought it was just like a little paragraph. That was all it was. Oh, I think you click on it and there was something. There oh, was really? like a picture. Oh, I didn't write it. Oops. Oops, didn't write it. <laughs> I did. He just shared it, didn't put anything. I went back in and I was like, you know, giving kudos about to, Mr. Chris. To the first. <laughs> a day late and a dollar short as usual. Um, so you don't use foam to keep the flowers fresh more, fresh Actually, for more time? Foam uh can make the flowers not be as fresh because of the the water amount of water in the container so that's why we love working with just bases of water pure water i'm sure that the foam people aren't too happy about me saying that but so um someone said nice. that it is very windy in south florida oh, lots of people said great article and great picture oh well, thank you if only they knew about that picture remember <laughs> 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 Kind of like right now. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that was on shorts. So anyway, oh, go ahead and tell them, Christine. I'm sure you're dying to let it all out. Yes. 
So when Mr. Chris took that picture, it was for a magazine shoot. And so, you know, the night before, I'm like, okay, do you have a few different ties for them to choose from? Do you have your suit? And he's like, oh, yeah, I got it all. So I'm like, okay, no big deal, you know. Well, we get there, and he goes in the other room to change, and he goes, I forgot my pants. My suit pants are not in my suit bag. Well, here's the deal. I don't really dress up that much, as much as you would think I do, but I really don't. I only do it when I go to market and when I have events that I have to be at. So, it's not like I come to work in a suit. So, anyway, I, I just always put my pants back underneath my coat. So it's except all for this time. Yeah, except for this time. So, it's all coordinated. I mean, hello. And so, I don't know what happened. I think, I think what happened, to be honest with you, I think I got something on my pants the last time I wore them. Well, remember which, it was like that. a week after the um, Arkansas Florist Association. Because that's why you thought oh, it was all oh, together. Oh, oh, yeah, 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 yeah. So anyway, those pants So probably... yeah, he had on shorts in that picture, but none of y'all can tell, so it's okay. My perpetual shorts. I wear shorts all the time. Is Sumac because... Oh, sorry, go ahead. Go ahead. No, yeah. Is Sumac available year round? No. It's not. And this comes out of Oregon, I believe, or Michigan. So Miss yeah. Krista asked, are your children in the floral industry? No. My daughter is um a senior buyer for Sam's. If you ever buy any kind of chips or anything like that, she probably had something to do with it. And she's married to a football coach, right? And so, and then my son was a perpetual student for quite a while. And he has his doctorate in pharmacology. He did drug research on uh, children. It was his dissertation on that. And then he decided on a whim to go and try law school, and he got into law school with a pretty much full ride. So I have a lawyer, and I have a corporate America child. So There you go. So um, someone asked, do you ever use Parisian Shield as a filler? Persian Persian Shield, si I think. She loves the dark purple leaf to create depth. Oh, really? How fun. No, I haven't, but it sounds cool. Might need to try that, huh? Someone said that that shape of the last arrangement is beautiful. Well, thank you. So now oh, we're gonna we have go. a few people asking about Miss Norwood. Is she feeling better? She is feeling better. She is feeling better. Thank goodness. She's feeling better when I came back. We're going to yeah. bring her on set one day. Well, Maybe. You're going to drag her in here, probably. So. <laughs> probably. She is not much of a stair climber or a uh, or a uh, she will not have a picture made I'm going to tell you all that right now so Miss <laughs> Christine said I'm married to a football coach we consider ourselves widows yeah exactly and, and my daughter has twins who are 17 months and a four-year-old so she's basically raising three children by herself right now but but she doesn't I don't know how she does it but she does a great job and keep her real job going. So I'm gonna put two hydrangeas down here at the base. I've done one piece of sumac there. Let me move that out of the way there. So now I'm gonna go back and add for a little bit of height right in here. So Ms. Janet said, have you ever thought about having Mr. Chris show up with a surprise assortment of flowers and containers and arranging without any advance? Yes, we've actually did that when we first started the Happies on Wednesdays. It was called, what did we call it? Remember? The Chop Challenge. Chop Challenge Wednesday. We did it for a couple of weeks, and we can actually go back and do that because it would make my life a lot easier. Yeah, we could do that. We can do that. So I'm going to insert these in a clump right here in the middle. So what is your favorite cheese? Ugh. Let's see. I like all cheese, actually. Um, what is this container made out of? It's porcelain. It's a type of porcelain or a ceramic material. So I'm taking several of the leaves off of this one, off of the stargazers. I always tend to take all the leaves off the very top because it always, to me, looks kind of messy. Miss Melissa said, we're buckling down here in Lafayette, Louisiana, Lafayette, oh Louisiana for these hurricanes. Oh my goodness. I love Lafayette though. I actually did a design class there Miss Peggy said, stop what is going on with this post. I agree. I um, deleted them, so hopefully that won't happen. 
what happened? The lady about the favorite cheese said it like 14 times in a row. Oh, goodness. I'm not sure if it was a real person or not. Maybe a cheese, per cheese salesman. Oh, update. The guy hit again on Saturday. Uh -huh. And I, I went in and banned them all. Even went back on Friday and banned them more. And so if anybody else has any more issues with that stuff coming up, please let us know because we can... We go in and band it anyway if it's something that's really kind of wacky doodle or... Yeah, Miss Sherry just said the cheese question account is a fake hacker. Well, I did block them, so goodbye. Okay. Goodbye. See ya. So now we're going to use some amaranthus, plain amaranthus. Now this amaranthus, either you love it or man, it drives you crazy because it, it actually hangs. And so if people think it's actually wilted and I promise you it's not. So will these um, Stargazer Lilies blooms bloom out later? Yes, they will. And as long as you take, and something that we found that's really crazy too, kind of like the hydrangea, if you take all the foliage off of those, they tend to always continue. Off the hydrangea? Off the lily. Take all the leaves off the lily, all the buds come up too. Let me come back and add a little bit of pizza. I do love that amaranthus. Well, I'm shocked because it's not normal. I know. So there's Did you do the flowers for your daughter's wedding? Well, duh, yeah. Miss Susan said. Of course, said, it's one of the. So it's one of those things, though. You always say your child's going to do this, or you're going to do that, or you're never going to do that, or you're going to have this color or whatever. Everything I said that we weren't going to ever do, we had to do. So anyway, it's okay. It's okay. It was beautiful. Yeah, it was. We'll pretty. have to send pictures. We, it was pretty. Show pictures. So last but not least. So we have lots of family members that are preparing for these storms. Oh my gosh. You're probably gonna lose power too. I hate it. We have friends from Kentucky on today. You know they say that we're supposed to get storms. I know. It's supposed like, to start raining tomorrow. Like tornadoes like on Thursday. Oh gosh. Well that's not fun. Well, no, not fun at all. We have a big wedding outside this weekend. We'll be over with by then. Oh good. They may not have any power, but they may be over with. Have you ever seen doubled stargazers? Yes, those are called rosa lilies. And we have them, we've had them on before here. The triple petals, some double petals. Oh, we gotta say a couple hellos. We do. So it's to Rush in Ireland. Have, hello to Rush in Ireland. I need to look it up. Or do we know? No, I not. don't know. And then there was. Um, hang on. I sent it to you. I One know. Can you go back in your phone and look right now? No, because I have a video up. Hang on. Let me look. Hang on. We got to do it. This one is a very special we gotta one because we're we're thinking about her. Oh, Anderson. Yes. Yes. Ms. Yeah. Anderson. Trish. Trish. Trish Anderson. Trish Anderson. She started cancer. She had cancer surgery this morning. Yep. Breast cancer and treatment. And her or husband. Cancer. Texas and want to know if we would give her a shout out. And said everything and looks ask, like it's going to be fine. Every, everybody's going to be fine, but everybody say a little prayer for Trish because she just started her cancer. Yes. Stuff. And then, uh, is it Sarah? It's not Sarah. Susan. No, Sarah. I only Ireland. got the Anderson one. Um, I'll have to look it up and do it tomorrow. I'm sorry. But it's for Rush. Rush wanted me to say hello to her, I believe. Or was it the other way? I always get kind of confused because I think he's not, he's text from her stuff. But, or is it the other way? I'm not exactly sure. So we have someone saying that there is a hole in the middle of that arrangement. Were you trying to do kind of where it's on one side and yeah. not on one side? Yeah. What's yeah. that called? Pa well, I just think style? groupings of color here. Oh, I see. Yeah. Like hole here? I think that's what they're saying. Uh, yeah, we paid good money for that. Oh, anyway. we paid good money for that, y'all. <laughs> anyway. I could do this. I could pull that up a little bit. that make you feel better. That'd make you feel better. So then those will open up like that. Perfect. Perfect. We have friends from South Dakota, from the UK. You can add a little bit of that in there if you want to. Man, this stuff scares me so bad, though. It hurts. Ooh, it hurts. It'll cut you, I'm telling you. Yeah, I don't want that here. No. Mm -mm. 
So anyway, so we'll add a few pieces in there. That make everybody feel better. Better, better, that better. That will make Miss Joanne feel better. Okay. That we have lots of people saying that they're going to pray for Trish. Yeah. That's very nice. We are as well. Yeah. So everyone loves your laugh. They just think it's the best. <laughs> <laughs> if you can't laugh about it, it ain't worth it. Is this so, like chopping block going to fall over or you think it's okay? Well, even if it does, what are we going to do about it? It's all right. That will just be part it, of the happy. Part of the happy. <laughs> Hot yeah. mess happy. It's just, it's just setting, teetering on there, but That's you know how right. we go. But at least the apples aren't rolling off the thing. So anyway. So another trick too is you always want, and I've talked about this before, but you always want to take these off. Because if you get these on your clothes, they're going to stain or on carpet or anything else. So you always want to get rid of those, especially, it's better if they're not fuzzy or bloomed out yet. But Someone anyway. said they like the small arrangement best. The small arrangement best. This of course, one? Janae says today is my favorite stargazers. Ah, uh, well, you know Janae, she got to live. She lives for stargazers. She does. She wants her, uh -huh. you know, everything to be stargazers. Yeah. So Miss Terry is from Maryland. She's watching today. Miss Anne Marie said this is just beautiful color, a beautiful color palette today. We're trying to kind of transition into fall with a hint of pink to it. It'll be kind of fun. Ugh, it's kind of weird. Well. Miss Caroline says she's loving the new wider table. Oh, good. Miss Gigi said she has stargazer lilies in her wedding. Miss Carol said you help her get through the lonely days. Oh, Blessings. Well, well, we can all help each other. We'll stick that one right in there. And I think we're in pretty good shape today. What do you think? Looks pretty. Okay, we missed you. Glad you're back. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Well, like I said, we haven't looked up today at all. It's been like this. We really haven't. <laughs> it has been... Here, do this, do this, do this, do this, yeah. do this. So, it's been anyway. crazy. Anyway, so that's all we got today. Oh, let me spin that around. Not much to it. Just real simple, easy little clutch. So um, everything's simple for you. Whatever. For some of us, it's not simple. Well, it's just we just like to just, watch you do just it. Just go. Well, job security. Anyway, we will see y'all tomorrow. We've really got to get on the fall stuff, guys. Of course, there's a bunch of stuff that just came in, so I'm hoping they're going to get it all done. And I actually worked today on trying to put together some things we can make packages of dried to send out. Perfect. That's th what that order was. I gave you at 11, whatever. Yeah, we have, you know. they emailed back about one question, so we'll have to go look. Okay, at no problem. Anyway, we will see y'all tomorrow. We're glad you're back. We missed you yesterday. Um, glad everyone made it safely. Oh, I just hope everybody's okay in all these storms and the I fires know. and oh, just so much going on. So. Oh, and Miss Trish is watching and she said, thank y'all all so much. Oh, well, so. good. Good, good. We're thinking yeah, about yeah. you. So we will see you tomorrow. Y'all have a blessed night, safe night, and thanks for watching our happies.